uh, just want to give you a brief little history, a bit of a rundown before we have the, the first initial test. So me and my mate Rico, <laughs> uh, we've gone halves in this beautiful old, apparently leak craft fiberglass hull. Um, it's running a Holden 179 HP which we have been told um, has a stage 3 head, a pretty fat cam in it. Um, as you can see it's got a sweet old um, Glen Carby heat exchanger uh, which has a big water jacket through it. Um, it's got a secondary water pump there which looks like it pumps into a coil which is in the sump and it's a V-Drive boat, so Argo V-Drive, um, pretty old school, we're told it's maybe early 70s, um, as you can see it's a, it's a cool old clinker shape, it's got um, some tav plates which look like a, a later on kind of addition, um, it also has this big fin in the middle which is kind of giving us a bit of hope and making us think oh it's probably been well set up um, back in the past uh, so we we just picked it up and the trailer as you can see is incredibly short so we need we're going to need to extend the drawbar on it but uh yeah this will be our first first run so we're pretty excited. We're, um, we've already put the bung in, so we can't forget that. <laughs> and um, Rick's just fixing up the trailer lights, and I've just got to make a little splash back cover for the, the rudder, where the rudder arm comes through. But aside from that, it's a pretty sweet looking boat. We got it for a song, and we need to, Velcro the seats in, and that's our hydraulic clutch, which is um, yeah, the original holding clutch, and the gearbox has just been cut off. So, yeah, should be a bit of fun. Sounding pretty mean. And that's all for now. So just doing a little walk around. It's a very sleek looking boat. I quite like its presence on the water. James looks happy as a pig in shit. Very sleek. Very sexy.
Very sexy. Very sexy. Very sexy. Hey guys, it's been a bit of a time um, <clears throat> since I recorded that footage. It's actually been a year and I'm only just um, getting to make that video now. Now that was the first test of the boat. We did have some issues that day. We had um, the water pump impeller failed on us. That was probably because we were running the boat without water for, oh, I don't know, 10 seconds at a time. Um, so yeah, look, we got a new impeller in it. That was sweet. Um, we ended up getting 33 miles per hour or something out of it. And um, yeah, it went, went pretty well. Um, so since then, we've actually bought a 1UZFE V8 to put in it, which we're gonna do eventually. Um, we had some other little issues, fueling issues. We had sand in the carbies. Um, we accidentally detuned it down to like 23 miles per hour. And then um, Rico has worked his magic on it and got it back to its healthy, um, I think we got it up to 34 or 35 miles an hour this time. And it's, it gets to that speed much quicker. Um, so I'll do another video soon. Um, but yeah, this is episode one of Vintage Speedboat Journey.